couple takes in starving dog only to watch him transform before their eyes Adopting a dog can require a leap of faith It's almost impossible to know what a dog has been through before you welcome them into your home Was their previous owner abusive were they living on the streets for long? Do they have abandonment issues a good shelter might be able to provide the answers to these questions, but there's no guarantee that was certainly the case with Wolfgar the Husky, whose past came with a number of mysteries and complications. Luckily for him and for his owner, all he needed was a little love, and he was ready to undergo an amazing transformation. When an Imgur user and her husband heard about a stray husky who was wandering around their neighborhood in November of 2015, they were intrigued. Yet when the couple ventured out and saw the dog themselves, it became clear to them that something was peculiar about him. He was deeply afraid of not just the woman's husband, but of men in general. As you can see, he's in pretty bad shape in this photo, wrote the Imgur user. Notice the patchy fur and the visible ribs. He also had a large scar going across his ribs. The couple took the pup, whom they later named Wolfgar, to the vet right away. A normal male husky ranges between 45 and 60 pounds depending on height. Weighing him at the vets, he was underweight at 39 pounds. The vet guesses he should have weighed closer to 50 to 55 pounds, wrote the Imgur user. He had demodectic mange, she continued. Huskies have two coats, so for the skin to be so red, dry, and patchy, he had to be infected for quite some time. Our poor boy was likely suffering for months. What would happen to him? The woman said his immune system was shot and the vet prescribed him a hefty dose of antibiotics and medicated shampoo. Miraculously, he had no heartworms or fleas. After a thorough checkup, the couple took Wolfgar home. We immediately bought a kennel for him to sleep in. He went in without difficulty, which led us to believe he'd been previously crate trained. We aren't sure of what he went through or where he came from. He wasn't chipped, not that we would have returned him anyway. My husband and I have a few guesses. He escaped on his own from an abusive or negligent owner, which might explain the scar. He was purposely abandoned. He belonged to an unlicensed breeder and escaped. Huskies aren't typically a breed you find wandering the streets, so we're strongly leaning towards the escaped theory, especially considering his wariness around men. It took some time for the dog to get used to his new surroundings. This is about a week after we brought him home, the woman's post explained. The first few nights he cried and cried in his kennel, but unfortunately due to his mange, we didn't want him sleeping in our room with us because the bedrooms were carpeted. During those initial days in his new home, Wolfgar would take a nap anywhere. He just seemed so exhausted from his ordeal. Now he primarily naps in his kennel or on a fluffy blanket in the living room, the story went on. Later on, he started to learn to appreciate the luxuries that new life afforded him. This is another week later, the Imgur user said. He's staring at a treat in my hand. Sometimes it's the only way to get him to look at the camera. This was the first visit to the local dog park. He had a fun time. I was worried about how he'd act around other dogs, but in typical husky fashion, he was friendly and playful right off the bat. He fell into the pond and I caught this wonderful moment a split second before he began to shake. There's nothing quite like watching a dog have fun, especially one who'd come as far as Wolfgar had. No big description, I just like this shot, she captioned this photo, and no wonder. After everything that he'd gone through, it must have been nice to see him so happy, calm and healthy. He plays well with most other dogs, provided they're also friendly. Since then, we've encountered dogs that are aggressive or bark at him. He's very quiet as far as huskies go, so he never barks back. He mostly stares in confusion, she said. Unfortunately, no matter how friendly Wolfgar tried to be, there were other dogs who occasionally didn't want to reciprocate. This husky shepherd mix wasn't too friendly, the woman explained. Luckily, Wolfgar didn't seem too upset by it. Wolfgar tries to engage my in-law's senior husky. Notice how sparse his tail is in this picture. Though you can still see signs of his traumatic past, it definitely looked like Wolfgar was very eager to start interacting with other furry friends. We noticed that as he grew in new hair, it began to change color. When we first got him, his coat was a distinct red color. Here and currently, it's more of a gray color and even dark copper in the sunlight. Wolfgar truly was beginning to look like an entirely different dog. After just about a month in his new forever home, Wolfgar's personality was really starting to shine. Now he loves car rides. At this point, he's put on a few pounds, 
though you can still tell he's pretty scrawny. If there was one thing in the world that Wolfgar loved more than making friends and riding in the car, though, it must have been taking naps. Hey, we can all relate to that one, right? Just look at how peaceful he seems in this photograph. You can see his neck fur starting to thicken, the injured user continued. He loves going into the backyard. He likes to sit and observe the other people in the neighborhood. When people would walk too close, he'd bark. We liked this protective aspect, though now he's much more discerning of strangers. I could stand like a normal dog, but meh. Wolfgar's owner wrote alongside this image. He almost looked like a cat, huh? It was remarkable to see how much fun he and his family were having together, especially given everything he'd been through. Still, Wolfgar's transformation wasn't finished. You can really see how his coat darkened in this picture. I'm hoping this is just a winter coat because I loved his red coloring before. Either way, he looked super handsome. He likes to rest on the cool tiles whenever we get home from a tiring day at the dog park. Sometimes he can't stay awake. It's hard to blame the little guy for wanting to nap. Having a blast at the dog park sure must have been exhausting. Like so many other dogs would, Wolfgar looked absolutely thrilled and delighted to be getting ready for a journey on the road. Since his owners had no way of knowing before they adopted him, it must have been nice to learn that Wolfgar loved riding in cars so much. The dog park is very close to the house, so I always roll down the windows for him when we're driving, the Imger user said. Every dog owner knows that life is easier when the dog park is a short drive away, and clearly Wolfgar was a fan. He's actually memorized the route. As we get closer, he starts whining and hopping around in the back seat out of excitement. Most dog owners probably know what that experience is like. Who hasn't taken the leash out and watched their dog totally lose it as they ran around with sheer joy? Remember how wispy his tail was before? It certainly is remarkable to consider how much Wolfgar developed over the course of just a few months, both physically and emotionally. His tail was one of the best examples of just how much he changed since his rescue. While his owners could never have known just how perfect Wolfgar would be for their family, they would have probably guessed that he'd be very curious about their people food policy. Get your nose out of there, Wolfgar. That husky stare, though. There's something absolutely enchanting about a husky's eyes, and Wolfgar was certainly no different. It's pretty obvious that his family fell in love with him right away. My favorite picture of him. He's now a healthy, happy, spoiled dog, and we love him and all the fur he leaves on our clothes. Hopefully things only get better for Wolfgar and his family from here on out. Clearly, there's nowhere to go but up. Wolfgar may have had a rough start to his life, but that didn't stop him from becoming the perfect family dog. It's great that this injured user and her husband decided to adopt him from his life on the street. Share this wonderful story with your friends below.